This video is for informational purposes only. There are risks to jailbreaking your iDevice and it does void your Apple warranty. So think before you act. Hey guys, what's going on? Matt here from today's iPhone.com and welcome to this week's edition of Jailbreak Tuesday where I cover all the latest jailbreak news. Now without wasting any more of your time, let's get to it. So starting us off this week, Firecore was updated for those who use Apple TVs and are jailbroken. It brings a bunch of new features with its update to 1.5. Also receiving an update this week was Red Snow, and this is kind of outdated, but Red Snow has finally been updated to have the Corona A5 untethered jailbreak installed into it, so now you can use it on Mac and Windows to untethered jailbreak your iOS device running 5.0.1. This does not include 5.1 and will not work with 5.1. One little side note with Red Snow, the iPhone dev team is currently working on building in built-in restore support, which is really cool, which basically means you're not going to need iTunes to restore your iOS device. So this week, Pod2G gave us an update on the iOS 5.1 jailbreak, and he has made it very clear that there is no ETA at this time. He did say, though, that they have all the pieces to the puzzle of the jailbreak. They just have to put that together, so they're working on that now. He then went on to say that a month's time may seem like a long time to us jailbreak users, but it's really not for him. It's a very large project, and since you know the whole jailbreaking and hacking and city thing for him is all just a hobby, uh, you know, a month's time really is a fair amount of time. But unfortunately, that means we're going to have to wait at least a month for you know any huge news to come regarding this jailbreak. At least that's what it sounds like. So this week, the free tweak to check out is Software Update Killer. It disables the software update feature for your iOS device, so you won't accidentally update. Uh, to 5.1 or any other future updates that Apple releases. And that's going to lead us into this week's Tweak of the Week winner, and this week's winner is Forecast. It's going to add the current weather in your lock screen at the top with the time, and it's going to add a very nice uh, look. If it's the sun or the clouds, it'll all be up there. It looks really nice. It's definitely worth checking out. It's Forecast 99 cents, guys, in Cydia. And that's going to wrap up this week's edition of Jailbreak Tuesday. I want to thank you guys so much for watching. Please be sure to subscribe to today's iPhone's YouTube channel. If you're looking to get in contact with me, all my social network links are down below in the description. And leave your comments because I do reply and read them all. Thank you guys so much for watching. Peace.